It's a gardener. Hi there. Please don't touch the plants. Well, I touched them. I... I touched the plants. Well... What the hell is that? I guess that's what happens when you touch the plants. Good evening, fellow Minecraftians, and welcome to uh, this week's server review rundown. So today we're checking out the Nymania server. Uh, formerly it was called Enderplanet, and the server owner uh, decided to sell it and start over from scratch with a new server. So this is his new place. It's called Nymania. Um, he's done some pretty wickedly cool things that I wanted to show off and showcase. So, uh, it is factions, I mean, everyone knows kind of what a faction server is, but I, I think what's really cool is that he uses this plugin here, which easily lets you see, hey, this is factions, and, and this is what you need. So there's your help tutorial. Uh, when you first join Spawn, you, you see that. And, um, we got three players online besides me. Let's see, we got me, and we got Dodie Klaus, and we got Diamond Thor. So we, we got some people on having fun. The first thing I look for on a server is, um... Is the server spawn? Is it enjoyable and fun? Uh, that that is the the key number one first thing to look at. And when you first join this server, uh, the spawn is big, massive, huge, and enjoyable to, to explore and search around in. Uh, it's really something. Um, I mean, I don't know how to explain it, but the the server's got a great spawn. Uh, and I've got a guy coming at me right now. Uh, now, once you leave, that's you know you're on your own. It's it's basic survival server out here. Uh, see here, I got mobs coming at me. Hey, mob. I killed you. I killed you, Mr. Mob. Oh, darn it. Look at that. I got more. So I'm going to go back into the protection of spawn here. Because I, I don't like the way these guys are looking to explore around in with friends. And I think that's the real, real important thing there, man. Look at that. That's just beautiful. That is just... Just spiffy, dandy, beautiful. Got a little moat around it and everything. <laughs> so that's the number one first thing, and that's the most important thing. Uh, oh, well, that was random. That was a mob. A little baby mob. So as you can see, our spawn is absolutely beautiful. And how's uh take you around inside? We're gonna we're gonna come inside. Hello, Mr. God. Hello, pretty. Uh, he uses a random teleport plugin that lets you uh, travel around and get to that right easily from spawn. So the server uses a really great economy plugin. I think is really unique and, and fantastic. Uh, so what the plugin is is you just do market, and then you uh, to, to create something you do. Uh, for instance, I got this, this bow here. You do, or for instance, I got an ender pearl. That's random. I don't know how I got that. Uh, you do market create, market create, we'll do five, two dollars, five ninety nine. And there you go, uh, the item's listed. And so then you can go to uh, listings, and you can see here, there's my item right there, uh, two dollars. Uh, so every single one of these items is, wow, that seems like a lot for a piece of bread. Uh, every single one of these items is from players. Uh, you can get on here and just sell your items on a you know global marketplace, and as it fills up, you can change to the different pages, um, and other players will buy these items. So I, I think that's really just a a spiffy plugin. Um, I actually made a dollar. I put a pumpkin on there a couple days ago and, and sold it for a dollar. So okay. So something else that I look for on a server is uh, is the rules. Uh, the rules are the number one deal breaker for me on a server. I, I think personally, if I'm hanging out on a server and I'm learning the rules and the rules are, you know, just annoying as heck, uh, I'm not going to be on the server anymore. So as you can see here, the guy keeps it below eight, Zaxomia keeps it below eight rules. And all the rules are pretty simple to follow. Uh, if you really, if you look at rule four, which I think is the coolest, uh, rule four is uh, griefing and raiding is allowed. Finally, a faction server that gets it. Finally, a faction server that allows you to grief and raid, because that is what factions is about. If you don't want factions, use protection plugin. 
But anyway, that's a, a rant for another day. Um, this server is really just unique to play on, really unique to unique and fun to explore on. It's it's faction based, yes, but um, you know he he doesn't focus, he doesn't divide his time between uh, games and creative and all these different things. He he does one thing, and he does that one thing good. I mean, he just he does it good. Uh, it just he just needs more people, just more people to come hang out on the server and have fun. It's it's a great server, guys. Look how beautiful. Look how beautiful. Uh, one last thing I want to show off. So one thing that's kind of cool is uh, he uses quests. You can see here. Uh, yeah, I got a mappy map. Look at that. So all I gotta do is, is click on the guy with the map in my hand, and then uh, choose an option, which is navigating. You can't start without the map, go inside that pyramid outside, you should be able to get the map there. What the crap are you talking about? I got the map in my hand, you bojo. Bojo the freaking clown. Okay. Okay, well I'm gonna, I'm gonna go get that map. Okay, so I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go make me a pickaxe and come back. And we're back with a big axe, checking out the quest. So we're gonna see how this thing works. Let's see. Could you mind ten blocks of stone? Deliver the ten pieces of copperstone to me. Accept quest. Yes. Hey, <laughs> break stone. Seems simple enough. All right, we can do that. So it seems like a simple quest. And look at that. I'm right next to stone. So I'm gonna I'm gonna mine me up some cobble. And this allows you to see the lag on the server. Really not too bad. Uh, you, know, you, you, can, you can build and, and mine and, and do your thing, chicken wagon, without that. Yeah, I'm a little bit lag now. Oh, there you go. I'm gonna complete it. I'm a cobblestone quest Damn. master. Yeah. So I did a quest, I got a point, and I got 100 money and 10 experience. Um, some quest can be... Ooh, Ooh find a treasure. A golden marker, there it is, too, right there. I'm gonna walk over. That's pretty, that's pretty freaking cool right there, man. Uh, there's, there's a gold... I got a treasure map. I got a treasure map. I got a treasure map. We're gonna go find ourselves some treasure, homie. My way. And through the magic of video editing, we are now at the cove. Uh, so, so you can see, I didn't even know this place existed. Been on this server for about three hours now and did not know that this place was even here. Uh, look at that, isn't that... That's just cool. That is just fun to explore. And, and so now we're going to go see this guy called Paul. Mr. Paul top here and he's supposed to give me more instructions on what I'm supposed to do. Hey, hey Paul, how, how you doing? Do I, do I use this map? Oh, look at that, look at that. The, the map changes. That's, isn't that fancy? The map changes and it's all new. That's, that's, that's really, that's fun. He did a great job with the quests. Uh, I, I'm just... I've never done quests before, so they're so cool. Um, so, with an intended gold applicant on the west coast of the cove, if you get close, so so we're going to the west coast. We're going to the west coast. All right, so so here we go. We're going, we're going west side. I made it. 
made it to the top. I made it to the top and there's... Okay, so I made it, but uh, there doesn't appear to be anything here. So we finally got that apple. We're bringing it back to the quest master. We're gonna see what happens. So this has been Hoopty Coop, and uh, thanks for checking out this week's server review. Uh, we were checking out Namindia and uh, having a look around uh, some of the really cool builds he's been doing. And uh, so you can do quests. And as you do quests, you'll actually discover new parts of the server that you did not know existed, such as this right here. Uh, I found this from doing quests. So, it's all wording around Spaniard, Spanish town. It's, it's a fun little place to explore. Uh, he's done just a fun job with the builds. <laughs> Look at that. Uh, I think it would be really cool is if we get to have a little war or a fight in here. I think that'd be something. Um, but either way, the, the, the owner's done a great job with, with building designs, and uh, the server spawn is awesome, and it's, it's a fun server to explore, I mean, you just kind of like, you never know what you're gonna, what you're gonna find in here, and this was one of the things I found, this random little town up here in the middle of nowhere, woohoo, walk, man, I'm just, I'm just seeing where I can go, because this is, Cool. That is just that's sh sh spooky, but cool. Well, isn't that just a pretty boat? And on that note, that's where we're leaving off on a really awesome-looking boat. So I'm about to catch that boat and sell my Bart to another server and explore some new lands, explore some new realms, but uh, this is definitely a server I want to come back to. Uh, there's, there's a lot to explore and a lot to, a lot to experience. Um, and I've only checked out two of the towns, uh, Tortuga and the Coup, and there's a whole other place to go look at. And they have this awesome boat. I mean, look at that. I mean, just... So the guy's a, a great builder, and he's built some some pretty fun stuff. Uh, this little cliffside house thing kind of gives me some ideas to to make some builds. Thanks for watching. This has been your server review of Namindia. I uh, hope you enjoyed, and uh, definitely come check them out. Uh, they're a fun server to kind of make your home on. Um, it's look at that. Look at all these fun builds. I mean, it's just you just want to go explore that. I mean, I'm in the town of Tortuga right now and I'm about to go off and do some exploring so I'll catch you guys later. Oh, oh, sorry, 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 sorry. I apologize, sir. I apologize. Please, no. No, oh gosh. <laughs>